Hey everybody, Chad with Nobody Else's Auto. As you've been hanging out with us, you've been seeing the progression on this 1939 Cadillac. We brought you a few videos on this before. Like we talked about before, this is a low mileage original car that somebody had pulled the motor out of over 40 years ago, had it overhauled, put the whole thing in storage, and that's how we ended up with it. We bought it at an estate auction, and basically when they sold it, they said, there's the car, there's the motor, the transmission and the other stuff's over in that pile, it all goes together, and we're selling it. That's how we bought it. Now, when Addie was home over Christmas, if you remember me and my dad and Addie got the heavy stuff done. We got the transmission back on the motor. We got the motor and transmission back in the car. All that big, bulky, heavy stuff, we got that done over Christmas when she was home. Well, since then, my dad and his buddy Jay have been getting a lot of the fine details done, getting things hooked up, getting wires routed, stuff like that. And we think we're about ready to light this thing off. So we're gonna take a quick look at what they've gotten done since we got the motor and tranny in it. Then we're gonna see if, it'll, uh, if she'll light off. So here's where it's at right now. Pretty much got everything hooked up, fuel lines, wiring, things like that. Now, one thing about these GM cars of this era, the coil was part of the ignition switch. It was all hooked together, had a big metal sheath around it that went all the way to the car. The coil, the factory coil, hooked to the ignition switch on this car was not functioning when they tested it. So as of right now, we've got an extra coil mounted here to see if we can get this thing to light. So since that coil didn't test good, this original one that is hooked to the ignition switch, we've got an auxiliary one here and got it all wired up to see, uh, see what happens. Got a new battery in it, got everything hooked up, exhaust is hooked up, fuel, all the plug wires are run. Think everything's hooked up and uh, time to see what, uh, what this old Cadillac can do. And hopefully after, like I said, we found the receipts on this engine, it was overhauled around 1981. So it's been out of the car and done for a little over 40 years. Finally, 40 plus years later, she's back where it's supposed to be, back in the Cadillac. So let's see if she's alive. On prime gas and uh, I think we're good to go. We're gonna give her a shot, see what happens. Use the starter switch out there, yeah. We're trying to put it in gear. We're going gear. Yeah, it's in gear, she's moving. Yeah. Yep, went through all of them. Let me know when the wheels stop, I'll see the roof one. Okay, they're stopped. Yep, you got reverse. Yeah, how much oil pressure? So we got good oil pressure. Well, she's alive. Sounds good. Pretty excited about it. Like I said, didn't let it run real long. Obviously, we don't have the radiator or anything mounted yet, so we don't have any of the cooling system hooked up. Let it run for a few minutes, get it run through the gears. Obviously, we saw it go through all three gears, saw it go in reverse. So everything's hooked up, everything's working. Kind of amazing considering this engine has been out for 40 plus years. 
a lot of these components were probably gathered up in 80, 81 when this thing came apart, but it all went back together just like it should. And uh, it's working and it's functioning. So that's pretty exciting, but uh, pretty neat to see it all come together. Fuel system, gas tank looked good. We stuck a bore scope down the gas tank. It looked clean, put gas in it. Fuel system pumped right up, fuel bowl filled up, did exactly what it should do. It's not leaking out anywhere. Put oil back in it when it built oil pressure, it had good pressure, it wasn't blowing oil out anywhere. So I feel pretty fortunate that this thing all came together as well as it did. So still got a little ways to go, but it fired up. It sounds great. We're really excited about it. If you missed the other videos where we showed you a quick walk around on this thing, you'll definitely want to go back and check those out. We'll put a card in here so you can catch those. And then once we get her up and going, we will show you some more of it. One thing we haven't showed you that we do know now, we did get into the trunk and found some super cool stuff in the trunk too. So we'll bring you that later as well. But at least now, you know it's running. It is alive. And uh, it's got a bright future. So we're going to get back to work on this thing. And uh, when we get it all buttoned back up, we'll bring you another video on it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed these. Yeah, Hope you enjoyed the progress. It's a pretty cool car. Can't wait to show you more of it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Catch the other videos on this car. 35,000 mile, original paint, original interior, 1939 Cadillac. It's super cool. You don't want to miss it. Like I said, you can't wait to see you going down the road here pretty quick.